All right. Well, back you. Back you? Thank you. And back words. Hardness. <laughs> uh, anyways, thank you uh, for joining me again once more for uh, Tuesday Evening Skyrims with Valkyrie. Yeah. Um, yeah, so... <clears throat> Real quick, um, I am going to talk. I'm going to try not to talk too, too much. My uh, kind of hurt my throat earlier today. Um, technically fine, but it's just <clears throat> every so often my throat feels really, really, really itchy. And uh, it is what it is. <laughs> So I believe this is our, I don't know, Let me guess. Someone stole 15th or 16th episode so far. Um, there's my Lydia. Come here, Lydia. Yeah. Um, don't know. I don't remember exactly what I had planned. I think it was just a bunch of random stuff. Yeah, one more bear pelt. We need that. Uh, kill the giant there. Find the helmet. The rum and the whatever. The whatever. I don't think I. Uh, Nord Avatar. What does that mean? I don't know. Seems there's no end. Take a look. All right, where are we? Um, I can sell things, can I? Not really. Alright. Oh, I probably... You know what? Hmm. Blades, helmets, Do you have a needs. bear pelt for sale? Because then I could just go right away. You do not. Okay, whatever. Alright. Return anytime you need. Yep. Okay. So we have a thing over here. Rimrock Barrow. Find his helmet. Okay. So. If I go to. Orphan's Tier and walk. Around. The ice flow. I think I'll, I should be good. And then maybe I'll get lucky and get that. Uh, like there'll be like a... What is that over there? Is there... Something way over there? I mean, there must be, right? <clears throat> yeah, I don't... Not gonna... Okay, mud crab. Not gonna pick on anybody. Is that... I guess that's going in the right direction. Is there another cave up here? Lower steep fall? Interesting. And yeah, there's definitely... Oh shit, sorry guys. Not trying to pick a fight. 
Oh, why do I feel like... Uh... So, why'd you join the Stormcloaks? My cousin disappeared one night. Some say the Thalmor grabbed him. Alright, this has got to be a bandit hideout or something. Uh. Halt! What is this place? Privileged information. Now, move along. I mean... I guess. Huh. Okay. I'm not looking to pick a fight if I don't have to. Alright, so there's... Is that a dock? Ooh, spiky grass. I don't know what that's for. That's not something I'm familiar with. It's all good when it's all new. Oh, I'll bet you this says, like, uh, travel. Oh, that's the, yeah, all right, all right. I'm not going to mess with that. Okay. I'm 90% certain that is the vampire castle. Volk gear or whatever. And that's not what I'm trying to do. Nerd root. I was like, I'm not about that life right now. Okay, I'm not too worried about them either. And there should be... I should be pointing near... Yes, yeah, so we have... Rhyme Rock. Barrel right ahead. It's got to be somewhere... Alright, so... Alright, well I was hoping it was a bear, but uh, you know... Saber cat, not, not the worst. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be on the other side. Alright, so is it gonna be... Doing that mountain climbing crap.
Yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's how that works. Alright, so this must be another watch. Pine Frost Tower. Alright, the cave looks like it's over here. So I'm going to assume if I go around oh yeah it's got to be it right there with the little flag I am Rock Burrow here we go Hundred percent lost Lydia on that mountainside, but hopefully, yeah, she's with me now that we're actually in a place. <sighs> Flame and Interak, Arnanak. I don't, I don't really know how to pronounce it. I thought I got far enough away. Sebastian Lord. Yeah, I don't think I have anything. <coughs> oh, I, I mean... Our sweet roll. Alright. The real barons I have volume two. The ruins of Kemel Z. Kemel Z. Kemel Z. What's the joke? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Children are nude. They are nude paraphrased. Sounds cute. I like it. Alright. Hmm. 
Cool, 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 cool. Hi, Lydia. Oh, yeah, I'll take some food and stuff. I don't think there's anything in there of value. You know what? Screw it. No, that's not. One down. We were just in there, you dork. Oh, what? Oh yeah, I was like, we were just in there. Why are you like that? <laughs> All right, so I can. So real quick, I can give the rum to Falk, Firebeard. Hmm. What do you need? Nothing. Not from you. What do you need? Hello, new people in chat. I don't need any of this food, though. Ooh, a book I haven't read. Mm. Alright, so this is... Are these the two crazy? It is the two crazies. They're the ones that Just gave me the uh, the hip bone of Pelagius to get into the place. But, I don't want to mess with them yet. Or, as in, I don't want to do that crazy quest line as of the second. I will eventually, though. <clears throat> oh, uh, welcome to... Ginger Dragon, first time chatter in my Discord, or not Discord, um, <gasps> excuse me, what's it called? Twitch. It's not my Twitch, we share it, but you know what I mean. Um, if you like this, you can find me here every Tuesday evening <clears throat> at around 930, um, just kind of playing and having a lot of fun. Um, with a very heavily modified Skyrim, um, I am playing, oh, it's got blood on my axe, I am playing as a Valkyrie, uh, there's the, uh, Sovereign Guard in Skyrim, which is kind of like the Valhalla of standard, like, Nordic themes, and since the Nords are basically the Norse. Oh, it's a lot of money. I have a delivery. All right, the rum. Thank you. I developed a taste for it after a fair weather trip to Hammerfell. Excellent. Here, this is for you. Thank you. Yes, old friend. I'm afraid it's not good news. When you broke up the binding, Fortema escaped. We've encountered some of her minions. Oh dear. Spear says she's still in spirit form. Or we'd all be dead already. You've already done us a service in stopping the binding. But I need you to go talk to him. To see if Steer can tell us what to do next. Who's Steer? He's Solitude's priest of Arcane. 
He's the one who figured out Potema was still around. He'll help as much as he can. I completely forgot about I wish you well, the friend. Potema. Be careful. I think she was a spirit. At your service. It was uh they were trying to summon her, it was crazy. Hi Bryling. I can always find time to share a word with a warrior. Yep. You don't have anything for me. Do you have anything? No, not really. Does Elisif have my queen? It's a fine day with you around. Thank you, my queen. She's the true queen of the Nords. I don't care what anybody says. Please address all questions to the steward. All right, who do I have? Hmm. I guess I got a bunch of stores that I can sell crap at in the city itself. I gotta talk to Steer. I got a bunch of other crap I gotta do. Might be able to find another bear pelt somewhere, though. Don't, don't say shit like that to me. I am always on edge about random dra dragon attacks. Trust me, I know. Oh, that's right. Okay. For strangers, you're not so bad. Thank you, kitty. Thank you, kiddo. I know I'm not so bad. I appreciate it. Um. Jesus, that bird scared me. I thought it was a dragon shadow. Anyway, I think I'm going the right way. I probably am not. I don't divide fast All right. So here's the temple. <coughs> Excuse me. Don't care about the temple. Don't need any of those. I don't have to talk to anybody. I can go out that way. Oh, there might be somebody out and about that I have to converse with. Um, yeah, is this the uh, Fletcher? Might be able to sell some... Oh, I, I don't think I can sell... I don't think I can sell stolen stuff until I get the perk. That's kind of annoying. I don't want to stay Hello, cold. I just want to talk to you. True, I may look the part of dashing. An archer, huh? I've got just what you need. No, I'm not an archer, but I'm kind of hoping. <sighs> Excuse me. <sighs> Excuse me, even more jeepers. Oh, nice. I can sell that to you. And I can sell that to you. And I don't need to sell my lock fix to you. I'm Perhaps good. I'll be seeing more of you. Oh, snare. Oh. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Oh, I'm not trying to steal your stuff, dude. I I was just curious is all. All right, I can come back to him. Yeah, I think I just need to work on, is it speechcraft? Um, oh, there he is. Hey, my guy, I got your helmet back. Nope. Look at it. That's real Nord craftsmanship, that is. Let me show you an old trick I learned as a scout. Makes it harder for the enemy to notice you. It's best you leave me here. Nice. Thanks you for giving me some more sneak. I'll take it. I will take it, sir. Uh, Not ready to do the Civil War quest yet. All right, so I think it is my personal mission to ensure that the Bard's College preserves the great. Not much, to be honest. 
Their return was a shock to us all. Gerard Germain has some tomes about them in the library, if you're interested. Oh. What library? Yes. According to Giraud, our history's keeper, the portion of the Edda dealing with King Olaf might still exist in Dead Man's Respite. I need you to retrieve the poem. Right. Yeah, that's definitely something I want to do. As you may be aware, Elisif's husband, High King Torig, was recently killed. Elisif mourns her husband oh. deeply. She feels that a festival that burns a king in effigy is distasteful. I wonder what Viar if he's wearing the same clothes that the festival as many Tyria, Tyria, the girl from Raymond's front, whatever. I, need proof. I believe King Olaf's verse will provide that proof. All right. I think Giraud here would give you the best explanation of both it and the history of King Olaf's verse. You should speak to him about it. All right, I just might. I wish you luck in finding the verse. Appreciate it. As high priest of the eight divines, I bid you welcome. Cool. All right. I thought adventurers were supposed to look tough. Hey, you want to play a game? I do not. Figures, you elders are always so boring. I, uh, you adults are pieces of crap. I'm like, whoa, kid, calm down. Why you gotta be like that? Alright, is this... Hall of the Dead. Who am I speaking to in here? Can I help you? What the hell? Oh, steer. Uh, okay. Yes, though. You mean Rogvir? Yes, I made an appeal to Captain Aldous. He allowed Rogvir to have a proper Nord burial, as is the custom in Savitude. Well, that was nice of you. As a Valkyrie of Sovngarde, I appreciate that. All my life, I practically grew up in the hall. My father and mother were the priest and priestess of our kid before me, you see? Awesome. I believe I was put here to protect this place from the darkness that pervades Savitude. What darkness? This city has a long history of madness and murder. The Wolf Queen, Pelagius, the death of High King Torrid, and now public executions. Stupid kids I playing with the door in the background. Stories, <laughs> have no doubt, as pretty as its streets are, as jovial as the bards may be, darkness is drawn to solitude. Well, solitude does mean you know, single. Ah, Latena, former queen of solitude and one of the most dangerous necromancers in recorded uh, She was responsible for the Empire's near collapse almost 500 years ago. I believe I have a book about her. Oh, death and dragons, of course. <laughs> is not raised from the dead. She'll need help before she can return to the living. For the moment, the Wolf Queen has retreated to a place filled with dead, eager to serve her. She has gone to her old catacombs. Oh, snap. A few days ago, one of her servants busted through a wall into the Temple of Divines. We'll need you to go into the catacombs themselves. Okay. All right. Yes, I had Falk call you back because you were at the summoning. You have a connection to Potena now. You must deal with her. Right. I can provide you with help for her minions, though. This should help you deal with the catacombs themselves. Ooh, you, As to Potema herself, find what's left of her body. Turn undead. Skeleton. Remove it from the catacombs and bring it back to be sanctified by R.K. Sure. A curious figure. Unrepentantly evil and nasty, of course, but also astonishingly brilliant. Obviously, quite a necromancer at her end. She was always so close to being Empress. Despite her machinations, it was never to be hers. Ironically, if she were alive today, she'd be the only living member of the Septim Bloodline. By all rights, she would now be Empress. Oh, snap. All right. May Arke bless you with a long life.
All right, he said he might have a book on her. And I have it on reasonable authority. I, that's probably not something I would have. Uh, I would have read. Could be wrong. It's a nice axe. Nice sword. I'm going to see if I can improve that sword and see what it does for me. Might not do anything uh, higher than one. I think what's the the hammer I have is oh, 84. Oof, rough. That's a lot of damage. That's a spicy meat the ball. I don't think I can get it. Cause I if I remember correctly, the sword that I picked up had what a base Oh just catacombs. Okay. Has a base uh damage of sixty. And I don't think going from uh to to making it stronger. Base plus whatever. I am Uncertain. Okay. Oh, I did. Oh, all right. Did read the wolf cream. It's all good. Multi band, bellissimo. Yeah, I don't really need the extra leather. I'll take the child's doll and the wooden sword. I think I can give those to my boy. Thank you. Frostbite venom to make more black leather. Yes, please. doesn't really have anything. I mean, the frost resistant necklace would kind of be nice, but I'm not really worried about it. Alright, let's, let's, let's get at all, Lydia. I do. I think I gotta find a chest. Um. Out fighting dragons. All right, Olas verse defeat Potama. Let's get rid of that for a minute. Should be only one thing in here. I don't really worry about that. Wait a second. Now, well, let's. I mean, let's do the one. What do I get? Guard duty. What do I get? Guard duty. Okay. Oh! Wonderful! I knew I could count on you. Thank you. I don't have any money to give you, but I can show you the tricks I learned playing for the Winterhold Wizards. You can say you've met the most talented bard in all of Skyrim. Nice. I think she just—I mean, I don't—I won't use it, but she just increased all of my magic stuff by one or two, as I can recall. Jari. You're passing through solitude. Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? Maybe. Would you ever mind? It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground. Or just left lying around in someone's house. I bet the two of us are very alike. So why not take the next step? We can help each other. My sister Deja and I are treasure hunters. We like to collect things. Interesting. I'm listening. I knew you looked like a clever one. With the war, many more ships come through these docks, loaded with weapons and pay, but few people, and they pass through dangerous waters. Okay. We have an interest in one of those boats. 
the ice runner. Oh, that's right. The solitude lighthouse will be guiding it in. But if its fire were to go out, the ice runner would run aground. Hmm. What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from their sad crash. Maybe. Turn me in for a tragic Oop. and very, very profitable event. Fair enough. It would be best if we spoke little until we've completed I agree. Alright, do I still have the... Yeah. You were there for Rogvir's execution. Most people head over to the Winking Skeezer. If you're not interested in music or drink, you can at least talk to Corpulus. He can fill you in on any of the latest gossip. Oh. People to see in places this? to go, huh? Later then. No. The aromatics. I think that's the, uh... What are they called? The local apothecary? Raiment. This is the skeever. Yeah, I actually don't think I've been inside here yet. Come on in. Got warm food, warm drinks, warm beds. So I'm not... You and me. You can say that. I own the place. Well, okay. My father owns the <laughs> skeever. He's like, it's, it's my daddy's bar. Business, so it'll be mine when he kicks off. Alright. Now I was done talking anyway. I have no business with you. Leave me. Go away. I have more important things on my mind right now. Oh, okay, yeah, I remember. Very, very faintly, I remember. You look like someone who nope. pulled their liquor. Nope. Ah, yet another new face. Huh? Where the dragon attacked? We've heard rumors of death and, and fire from the skies, but no real news. Though we should soon be selling arrows by the bushel. A sword is no good against a dragon. That's not true. Aye, but I'll be here in solitude for longer still. Fiata's skill as a Fletcher drew me to this place. Okay. I wanted to learn. And there is still much of Skyrim I wish to see. I hear there is a city, Windhelm, that is nearly white with... What do you call it? Oh, uh, yeah. Snow. Eh. And far to the west lies a ruin, Polskyg. Inside, there's said to be a wall, black as night. And it speaks in the ancient dragon tongue. Ooh, Volska. There are wonders in this place I never dreamed imaginable. Cool. Good to talk to a fellow traveler. Down with the brick. Feel free to make requests. Generally, if you want rumors, you should talk to Corpulus. That said, I did see a visitor pass through on his way to the Blue Palace. You should think nice. about staying the night. Corpulus keeps a clean inn. By blade or by spell. If you want it dead, I'll make it dead. All you need to do is pay my spell. He's like, by blade or spell. Oh. Been a good to me. That means something. When's your next one? Ain't got one. But I'd fancy a chance at that Jari Ra's scrawny neck. Filthy Argonia never would have set foot in this city. If High King Torig was still alive. Oh Jesus. I tell you that. That's not good. Leave your head about you. The not so subtle hint at racism. I don't like that. This is an ode to Skyrim. Staunch protectors. The Imperials. We drink to are to blah 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 the age of aggression is just about done we'll drive out the storm folks and restore 
boys close. Okay, bear pelt. There we go. 10 to 10. Ha ah ha. Finally. For what we own, with our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. Down with the brick. Hello, I'm Gizly. Yes, my older brother. And the person you probably want to be speaking to right now. But really, since Torig's death, Falk Firebeard wields the true power of the Jarl's court. My brother is Jesus. nothing more than a Call your own brother a pompous little fop. That doesn't seem like a good attitude. Oh, if you're looking for a good attitude, go see the bards. They'll fake it for you, if nothing else. I'm used to that. If you're looking for truth instead, see Noster. He's a good example of what life has to offer. And if you're just looking to feel good, go get some spiced wine from Yvette. But whatever you do, just leave me alone. My girl. Damn. We'll speak again later, if we must. Sure. Holy. I call that cynical. Talk to, I don't, I'm not going to drink with him. Welcome Corpus, to here we go. Friend. Well, as it turns out, I had a pet skeever when I was a boy, and he used to wink at me. They were smaller back then. Sure. What do you have to sell? Drink for the thirsty. Food for the hungry. Uh, I don't think I have anything to sell to you. Not really. Cool. Remember the winking skeever next time your foot's sore. Being old's not so bad. My daughter keeps me fed, but my working days are done. Watch what you're doing. I'm not doing anything. Stop telling me what to do. You're not my real mom. <laughs> Did I already look up and down all these? I'm not really here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, I didn't get everything that I would want out of that, but it wasn't too bad. And now I can also go back to Temba. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Hey, will he tag? Nope. <laughs> I sure do not, child. I don't know where she is. She's probably with the fishery or something. I'm sure. Yeah, let's see if I go out that way. <coughs> do, 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 do. I think if I go up here, can I? Not really. Whoop. Yeah, so she. There's a lot of birds. That's alright. Am I gonna fall and die if I do this? Looks like I might. <laughs> Be stupid! Like, I. Uh, yeah, no, well, it's Tuesday for me, so. Stupid is my middle name! position because my cousin is the emperor ah yes if she wants to pay the 2,000 gold tariff then we'll be all set 
Damn, Terra. I suppose I could make an exception. I do like her spiced wine. Yeah, make a deal with her. Tell Yvette Son her shipment will be brought up to Solitude shortly. Perfect. Perfecto. Now the question. Okay, so there's dead, man, dead man's respite. And then there's somebody out in the open. It's got to be Temba down here. Where was it at? Yeah, return to Temba. So let's go to Ivar's dead. Let's give the lady back her bear pelts. Got the bear necessities. <laughs> Why do you guys never have nothing nice to say? Jesus. I clearly don't give a whoo. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? No. I'm about to make a delivery up there myself. No, I don't want to deliver your goods to the... Oh, oh, she's up there. I forgot she was the lady who... Uh, I don't know if she owns the mill or if she just runs it. Oh, speaking of new people. Who's this? Oh, you're a traveler. Oh, uh, no. You must have so and much to tell about uh, the world outside this boring town. They call it the path town. to the monastery to 7,000 steps. Can you imagine? I'm not certain if I could even make it to the top without collapsing from exhaustion. Hey, that's a little funny. I have already been way up there. Nothing for anyone here. All right. You must be another pilgrim on the way up to High Hrothgar. Oh. Honest pay or honest work. Nice. It's frightening living below their monastery. Why? Sometimes I swear I can hear strange noises rolling down from up there. It's like thunder. It sounds like thunder. I mean, they literally shouted. Any rain. What do you make of that? Oh, but Kim, 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 Kim. Sure, leave. Everyone else does. That's funny. All right, Temba. These damn bears are driving me crazy. Nice to finally meet someone who can follow simple instructions. Oh, why Here's your why you look so mad? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to get back to work. My business oh, is falling up. If I hadn't sunk every bit of gold, I... The Greybeards stay away from me, and I stay away from them. Suits me just fine. Okay. Kill a few more bears, All right, so... 80 base for the Warhammer. <coughs> oh, that's not bad. 74 for the sword. I think all of my two-handed thingies are not yeah, they're... Ooh. So, Warhammers. Ignore armor. And that's what I'm doing. Yu-Gi-Oh! Alright, what else do I got? So, under miscellaneous. Yeah, I can go back and tell Yvette. And then I have find Olaf's verse. I think all those I can teleport to. <sighs> Alright, so this is... Rorkstead is where... Alright, they are. I need to know where she is. So she's... Like in your skier. Okay. And then the other place I got... Uh, go to Solitude to tell Yvette. And then I got Dead Man's Respite. Which, if I go to Morthal, I think I can go to down here, cross over. Yeah, so let's... I might as well do a dungeon delve. That sounds like fun. Ow, it just hurt my elbow. That well.
Alright, so she's at her thing. Yep, there she is. Hey, 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 lady, lady. Wanderer like you needs a little fire in the vein. Thank you so much. I swear it's a fight with them every shipment. Here's something for your troubles. Oh, very brisk. When the snow sets in, even the hardiest Nord needs some spiced wine to warm the blood. Yep. But I'm I'm gonna go look for your uh Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? Citizen. Not much, that's for sure. Alright, so I said Morthal. So Dragon Bridge. Yeah. Alright, so I need to go southwest from Morthal. in southwest so in that direction go fiddling with any locks around. oh did the dragon show up oh, it did didn't it there it is It's gonna crash down, come on. is a lot.
never would have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. It's really dead then? All right. I never would have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. Okay. Well, you saw it. Now believe it. <laughs> Alright, and I definitely have a guard back. Yeah, I don't care about this. Alright, you are. If you stand before me to accuse me of sacrificing children or eating the hearts of the dead, you may save your breath. I have done no such okay. thing. Okay. I was like, I that is a lot to take in, my guy. To live my life in peace. What? The people of Morthal would much rather weave their own horrid tales about my life than simply ask me for the truth. If they choose to fear me in their ignorance, that's their choice. But it will not change what is true. I mean, fair, but holy shit, dude. As anyone will tell you, Morthal can be a dangerous place. Yep. My talents are useful here. I help maintain order, even if it goes unnoticed. Uh, sure. The marsh is treacherous. You would do well to not wander at night. Alright, thank you. Till next time. You crazy, crazy man. Okay, High Moon Hall. I don't think I need to do anything for... To be an adventurer like you. Yep, this is... Alright, Apothecary? Thaumaturgist Hut. Okay, nobody in here? I mean... What was it, a bull? Wooden bull, I think.
another okay like there's no bed up here <laughs> oh nice uh, I read all those Interesting. I don't know why. I just, I, I mean, I know it's a business, but I thought it would be like somebody's home. Uh, all right, it's an inn. There's the burned house. Don't know if I can do anything about it yet. I think you have to... Something to do with this. You have to light something in it. or Do I need a shovel? Oh, I don't remember. If you are watching and somehow remember stuff that I don't, I mean, please... One million percent, feel free to chime in and be like this. Okay, so I'll go towards that and turn that way. So I'll go this way. Or maybe there's something to do with these cairns. I don't know off the top of my head. No. I'll figure it out eventually, but not right this second. All right, is this the correct? No, so that's the correct one. All right. Rock and roll. Alright, do I go? I mean, I'll assume I go across the bridge for now. Yeah. Y'all, baby. I'm gonna sneeze, but also, holy shit, they, they killed the mammoth. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I sneezed. Nope, wrong one. What do I got? 862 out of Jeepers Creepers. Hmm, 
Excuse me. Where the hell did I get 19 amethyst from? Holy crap. I mean, I'm not mad about it. I'm just curious. Well, there's another bear. Are you gonna stay over there or am I gonna have to kill you? this oh yeah nice Yeah, okay, cool, cool. Oh, Lydia, what are you fighting, you dork? What? Oh. Alright. A single werewolf. Or, not a werewolf. Not even a werewolf. A wolf wolf. Alright, let's go look over here real quick. Um, I'm gonna stop here for a second once I get over to this little building. Um, I'm gonna take a quick break. Um, oh, fish, Fisher's building. Crabber Shanty, nice. All right. Um, so that's gonna come up, and I will be back with you guys in a. All right. Well, thank you so much for waiting for a minute or two while I uh, took care of myself. Now, I'm looking at this little crab shanty. Um, I don't really need any of this stuff. So I'm not trying to like Gink dude stuff, I mean, but it's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The y'all can hardly eat every deer now, can he? Oof, that's a rough thing to state. Uh, I mean, technically, I think you're fine. I mean, you are like way out on the boonies, so I'm not. I'm not gonna tell on you. <clears throat> Isn't my uh, my position to take? 
And besides, I got bigger fish to fry, like this gorgeous amphitheater. But I didn't see it. I didn't see a uh, uh, what do they call the chest or barrel that I could just throw a bunch of random crap in. Was that tundra cotton? Oh, I might. I just might. Yeah, I don't see anything over here either. I don't know what we're gonna find inside. I kind of just need a place where I could store some crap. Do I have a house? I think I do in rural white run. I can come. Jesus, Lydia. Lydia, come here. Still here. How can I serve you, my thing? You can carry some of my stuff. That would be wonderful. Here. So. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that. Hold that. That, 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 and. Uh, let's see, 748. Do I have anything? I don't think I have anything heavy here. But you could, if you would be so kind, carry. All of those, all of those, and all of those. Thank you. Let's get going then. All right. Dead man's respite. Ooh, that scared me. I thought it crashed for a half a second. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. Well, it's always nice to see a ghost in the distance when you enter a tomb. Okay. What is it? The Ruby Dragon Claw. That'll definitely be the last thing I pick up. All right, I think this is the way, once we go through the dungeon, that's the way we come out. Okay, so. Oh, interesting.
the earth. I have a feeling, I was like, I think she's gonna set everything off. <laughs> Called it. You do. You know what, Lydia? You do you. Bone mold. I'm good. I already come this way. No, I did it. definitely didn't.
Yeah, that's kind of funny. It just knocked her straight off. <laughs> That song, it's a little bit funny. Does this door have a ward on it? Yeah, all right. Oh, excuse me. TikTok song, my money doesn't jiggle, it folds. Like, uh, no, actually, this is Skyrim, my money only jiggles. Dang it. Whoa, what? Hey, now. ballpark. Thank you. Oh, is oh, I was like, what am I looking? Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Hollowed Elven Bow. Very cool. Oh, I was like, where did I? I 
was like, did I lose Lydia? No, she just got stuck behind the the um, iron bars. Death to the non-believers! So yeah, a little backstory, uh, playing Valkyrie. <clears throat> I believe I said this in one of the earlier episodes, but I really like... Um, fighting and killing the Draugr. Um, largely because... Like, I feel like, as a Valkyrie, I'm sending them home to Sovereign Guard. Uh, because Draugr are like uh, Viking heroes or something similar. Um, I mean, they don't necessarily need to be heroes, but they're Norse, Nordic in this case. Ah, uh, buddy. by my friend. Thank you. Open it up, my buddy. Open it up, my boy. That leads us deeper and deeper. And now we're at the Sapphire, no, Ruby Claw. Oh, I leveled up. I'm sure I realized I did, but I did not realize I did. Ooh, no, let's, uh... Alright, where am I at for smithing? These are... Glass. Is that 70? Come on, dog. Alright, Ebony's at 80. <sighs> yeah. History of War. Oh, that's right. You may choose a race. Weapons and spells are 35% more effective. <laughs> this is a... Ordinator or something like that for races where... I guess Nords get... Ancestral Hatred. 
<sighs> trying to think, who do I fight the most? I think I'm gonna go High Elf, mostly for the Thalmor. Should be under effects, right? Daughter of Skyrim. Nordic blood grants 25% frost resistance. Avatar adds 50. Favored foe. Weapons and spells are 35 more. Effective. Snap. Ten, twenty, and thirty. Nice. All right, items. Miscellaneous ruby, sapphire, ruby, ruby. Dragon Claw. Alright, so we're at. What is that? Wolf, Hawk, Wolf. Alright. So. Exciting. It'd be kind of cool. It says race. It'd be kind of cool if you could do like Draugr. Like, who are we fighting? Lydia, we stop? Holy crap, dog. My lady. Whoa, 
sheepers, creepers. Eat all the food. Alright, now I can suckle down a couple potions. Let's get more health. Ooh, I got the sprint, dog. Bahaha, I said. Very nice, very nice. Very nice, I said. Yeah, I can play for a little bit longer. Alright, so. Return to the Bard's College. I'll go to Blue Palace. Who's this lady? Need something? Nope. Do fresh fish for you. Samari, yes. It's been hard on her. The girl misses her uncle. Oh, snap. I tried to explain that Rodbeer did something bad and that we all have to be accountable for our actions. But the child feels what she will. Yeah, that's fair. These are troubled times. Be on your guard out. What do you need, my friend? Dean of history. Actually coming ah, you've history. returned. Uh, not much, to be honest. I have to admit, I didn't think it would actually be there. Now, let's take a look at this. Oh. Oh, no. This won't do at all. The copy is incomplete. It's aged to the point that parts are unreadable. And the parts that are readable... Well, bardic verse has come a long way since ancient times. It means I can't read it to the court. Without the verse, I won't be able to convince Elisif of the importance of the burning of King Olaf Festival. If she isn't convinced of the festival's importance, then she won't reverse her decision to stop the effigy burning. 
It means that the burning of King Olaf, which the Bard's College has held for time immemorial, won't be happening. Make it up? That doesn't seem appropriate. I suppose I could copy his style based on what you brought me, but I have no idea what happened in between these verses. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed one -eyed betrayer. Death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, a con for the ages. King Olaf was Olaf One-Eye? He famously captured the dragon Numenex and took him to Dragon's Reach. What did we say really happened? Yeah. What's next? Olaf grabbed power, power by, by promise, promise and threat. threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Strange. According to history, Solitude attacked Winterhold, but this seemed to be saying Olaf reacted. What do we say happened? And they got the orders backwards. <laughs> yes, I'm writing that in. <laughs> it should be good for a laugh from the court. <laughs> it has a few final lines, but that's all we needed to add. I need to head to court immediately and present this. You should come. <laughs> I thought that's why I gave the dude back his helmet, so that he would uh, stop being a vagabond, but oh well. Still here. How can I serve you, my thane? Steel, I don't know. Lead on. Ooh. All right, well, she's going to need black, and I need. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? Well, <laughs> I was hoping you could help me uh, sell stuff, but perhaps not. What do I need? I need steel. Gosh dang it. Arms and armor, forged by a man.
completely forgot that I downloaded a mod that gave me a bunch of like interesting but ultimately wonky new weapons. So, you know, that's less than my Elven one, but it just looks so good. Paladin sort of looks like something that, uh, what's her face? Lydia would really get a, you know, a lot of use out of. Anything new? Oh, the Gladius. That... I will never make that. Plus 500 bonus additional damage. Oh. No reason to make it now. 2 OP. I did not know that was an option. What do we got? We got chit anything in chitin? Nope. And uh, other than the Warhammer, which is the same as my Elven one. Don't believe there's anything new. Yeah. So you need ebony and steel to make Lydia new stuff. And I kinda need. Yeah, I need to make a bunch of random crap. Actually, okay, so an iron dagger sells for 10. Hammer is ingot 3. I think daggers are 1 for 1. Uh, 1 for 3. I don't think anything else is 1 for 1. A different fur. Interesting.
Seems there's no end to the need. Take a look. Please have some steel. Turn any time you need arms or armor. Still here. I, I am at your command. Like you must have plenty of tales to tell, but I'm afraid I'm too busy to hear it. Hmm. Arms 
Russian army. Forge. Master craft. All right, what's my current quest? Arms or armor you need. See Baron in Castle Gao. Now you can fight. If those white run guards can take down the dragon, so can we. Okay. Huh? I do hope the court likes the verse. I think we've done. I think my voice is ready. I hope we've done this well. Seville Stentor has a grasp of magical theory that I would never have expected from a human, even a Breton. You are free to leave. Oh, hello. Just tidying up. Watch your feet. We just clean there. Ah, Viormo. I assume you are here to petition for the reinstatement of the burning of King Olaf Festival. I am, Jarl. I wish to present King Olaf's verse from the Poetic Edda, recovered this very day from the Bard's tomb. You mentioned something that would convince us the festival should take place, but I didn't expect King Olaf's last verse. Please proceed. Yes, ma'am. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, death-dealing demon and dragon I won't be able to relax until I'm sure Potema is dealt with. Any resident of solitude can tell you she was the deadliest person ever to come out of Skyrim. Oh, dang. Queen of solitude. <coughs> granddaughter of Emperor Uriel Septim II. 500 years ago, her fight for succession nearly tore the Empire apart. After 20 years of fighting, she no shouting match armies between of the dragon and man. No fire or fury did if this she battle entail. To power, Olaf struck a deal to make her. himself king. Numenex let go, though none tell that tale. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong. Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Olaf gave orders, winter hold disguises. An attack on solitude, total destruction to follow. His men dressed up and then went out to fight. But they reversed Olaf's orders, much to winter hold's sorrow. So ends the story of Olaf the liar, a thief and a scoundrel. We of solitude commit to the fire. In solitude, bards train for their service. They also gather each year and burn a king who deserves it. You have proven your point, Viarmo. The festival is truly a celebration of solitude and a condemnation of false kings. I thank you, and the college thanks you, Jarl. Furthermore, I believe that such a fine poem deserves some payment of patronage. The college will be moderately rewarded. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make sure our applicant, who was instrumental in recovering the poem, will be well rewarded. Seville Unbelievable! You have done us a great service here. I can't begin to thank you enough. 
Soon. Soon. These things must be done properly. You will be inducted as part of the festival itself. Nice. I need you to go speak to Yorn. He was preparing the effigy of King Olaf. Tell him to finish the preparations. The festival is back on. Viva. I won't be able to relax Same until driving. I'm sure Fakela is dealt with. Watch your feet. We just clean there. Stop it, Yuna. Very soon, yes. Unless we have specific business, I'm not interested. Fair enough. How much money do I have, actually? Now that I think about it. 14,000. I'm not even... My position, Dean of History, actually covers a wide range I was like, of subjects. I'm like 10,000 away. <laughs> Is this the college? Go fiddling with any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. Dean Inga says a bard can never have enough practice. So, would you like a tune? Thanks for taking the time. People never want to talk to me. I don't think I've been in here before. I think there's going to be a ton of books that are lit up. If you love history, you're in the right place. Skyrim is... I also kind of wish it was a, uh, like, not necessarily a chart, but, like, uh, like a list and then, like, like a quest, but, like, with a list of books, like, all the books that are in the, in the game. And then, like, once you have read them all like this and they're all lit up, or uh, in this case, not lit up, um, you get, like, a little, I don't know, maybe an extra perk, like a, you're super smart perk or something it, I think that'd just be fun I would enjoy that quite a lot not a little bit a lot of it that's all I'm saying I'm 
dean of loot, the bard's college. And no, I don't give private lessons. I... Excuse me. Yeah, I don't know what charcoal's for. I'm sure it's for something, but my brain just <coughs> doesn't know. It's all good. Upstairs first, get everything upstairs because it's going to be 2700 more books. The Trials of Saint Alessia, very cool. Tell me twice. Do 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 do. Thought I heard oh, the different volume. says my voice is second only to hers, but she's selling me short. Few can resist my charms. Even fewer are worthy of them. Sure. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, I don't care. Your charms mean nothing to me, young woman. Well, no, but actually, yeah, it's all right.
It would also be really cool if, like, when you read a book, if uh, somewhere it, like, made a copy and you could just read all the books that you have read without having to pick them up, steal them. Move them, save them, etc., etc., etc. I mean, I don't know if that would even be entirely possible within the the realm of the game, but it would be interesting, that's for sure. That is for sure. Ah, the bar to be. Did the arm? I'll tell everyone we're ready, but we'll start the festival at dusk. Okay. Come talk to me after dark. We'll get the festival started when you do. Cool. Meals are served to bards at designated times. Find an inn if you want to make requests. You look a little sturdier than most of the Ah, the bard to be. Did the armor send you? Farewell, stranger. All right. Well, I think the, the next thing we're going to do is going to be that. So let's... Uh... Let's call it a night there. Well, thank you all so much for joining me on my little adventure. Uh, I had a blast. Uh, we'll have to do it again soon. Uh, maybe, ooh, ooh, big stretch, sorry. Uh, maybe next week. I am undecided. I will... Post to our uh, Twitter whether I will be uh, streaming next Tuesday or not. Uh, don't forget, always, um, I stream on Tuesday evenings. And then on Wednesday evenings, we have uh, Casey, who is running his, uh, I believe it's the Silver Blades part of the original AD&D uh, four series games. Um, I don't remember what the last game is called, um, but... Uh, eventually he'll get to it um but he he streams at 6 p.m mountain standard on wednesdays which is i will see tomorrow um so look forward to that i don't know if we will be doing the following week but unless we post otherwise just assume we will um i had a great time i hope you guys had a good time with me and i wish you all a happy holidays and a good evening and i will talk to everybody later Good night and thank you.